an Arcadian prospect. He's one of the, I think he's a top five favorite to win the Arcadian. Agreed. So I think that's coming up in mid-April. And April yeah, 2nd. April 2nd. So I would not be surprised to see Kershaw plays very well there. I was a little bit surprised not to already see him make the, a PR spot. What was that? Very nearly killing him with the water. That was a shame. <laughs> Just gonna, yeah, water is such a weird interaction in this game because, you know, it comes from hydrant, which is also a projectile that can break, it's, that can, it's, that can be used as an option. So the, the thing about water is that it actually multi it in increases your momentum. So if you're like fast falling, it'll make you fast fall even faster. And that's I think what happened right there with ZD. Yep, that is something that you're gonna have to be very careful about. You cannot just toss down the hydrant directly below you. ZD can just reflect that. It will go directly up and smack Kershawn for a ton of damage. Yeah, these two. Oh yeah. <laughs> no option there. None whatsoever. I think get up attack might have been the safest, but ZD 100% could react to that. It's gonna yeah. It's gonna tra not even trade. It's gonna. Well, it's just. What, what's the word looking for? They kind of just numbed each other out. The Hydrant drop and mm. ZD's fares. Basically, you can deactivate it if you hit it with a, anything with a multi-hit. Yeah. These, so these two played in winners. I'm not sure the last time they played at, like before. I do remember Kershawn took a set off ZD. A while like, ago. A while ago. But I don't know if they played since then, like before today. But ZD is back with a vengeance. I think ZD has figured out how to play against a bit more of the campier playstyle. Because I'm not sure if you watched the draw. You were here last week, weren't you? Yeah, I was. He dominated uh, Oolong. He did. That was a brutal one for sure. But right now, we're kind of seeing that uh, he, he's fading in and out a lot better than he usually does. He isn't just kind of just running into Kershawn mindlessly. He's not trying to use his hitboxes and abuse the fact that his character is particularly quick. He's trying instead to just dash away and force Kershawn to claim space. Yeah. Can't neutral get up there. No, sir. High percentage neutral get up. Pac-Man has so many tools to blow that up. Pac-Man not like going into like... Pac-Man being able to consistently charge uh, his, his neutral B while being pushed off by water is something I didn't really think about, but it's super good. Because you can't get... You're going to really get pressure for that. Especially considering how good he is off stage and how much he can stall off stage. This character is basically always going to have tools there, but that is not a tool you want to go ahead and do. That trampoline, that edge can... Be huh. devastating. So that goes through hydrant. Yeah, today I and learned. That lingers quite a bit. Don't, don't neutral get up. Thank God, ZD. Oh, that's great tech. But, yeah, great tech. <laughs> yeah, again and again, you get a little bit of extra damage. But considering that Kershawn is down this much, I don't think you can afford these trades. Oh, he wanted the water push. Oh, 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 had to follow oh, up, but... oh, no. Back here, yeah. not going to connect again. But ZD actually holding down, it looked like, trying to go as low as possible. And... Bit of a suicide right there. So once again, we've seen this is yeah, ZD just... can get blown up or Oh that's yeah, messing up the nair. ZD not getting sent at the angle I think Rashawn expected. You're dead. Yeah, you can't air dodge there. Yep, did not hit the platform and that will spell a doom. So I think that perhaps ZD's up-tempo playstyle threw Kershawn off at the start of that game. It felt like he never got his footing set. All right, which FD are we going to? <laughs> oh god. Kershawn has uh, Kalos is banned, 100 percent so we're not surprised me if we saw we're going town, town. probably near town yeah because kershawn has complained a lot about when we had when we ran um we're, we're using you playing about the lack of fds but we've seen him complain when there's a lack of fds true i really think that this stage that we have is a little bit biased towards these campier characters oh, purely yeah. because we oh, only 100%. have one small stage as someone who plays campier oh, we're, we're we, we Kalos. allowed Kalos through instead of town that is shocking to me okay Interesting uh, pick. I don't know why ZD would leave this open with a Pac-Man on board. So he's, he's able to go ahead and, and potentially intercept the recovery a little bit more, but the fact that there's a solid wall, it, it gives him a, a wall jump, but it also means that his recovery is a lot more susceptible to being gimped. And there's also, uh, Pac-Man also has a wall jump to make his really great recovery even better. 20 times better. Probably top five in the game. I would say top, I'd definitely argue at least top three. Mm, I can see that. You can't because you can double place hydrant too, like off stage. Yep. And that's that's a lot of stall. Uh, jump exists. Side B. There's, it's Armor, so good. Yep. Oh my god! Fine. What you're a on, hydrant extension. You're on Kalos and the, yeah, you're gonna you're dead. And now we have big stage, big lead for Pac-Man and uh, ZD. <laughs> yeah, he just kind of has to watch Kershawn as he retreats to the far side of the stage and says, "Yeah, come play with me." I know you want to come off stage and play with my uh, my recovery, don't you? Oh, oh my god, so he got the good. back air! That is actually, that is a nice thing about those platforms, though, is that, that dash attack, if you miss the attack on it, 
Yeah, Kershawn is willing to play this, it looks like. But going to get the hit of the um, Galaga as it comes back around, but still going to trade with the... Well, lose to a Hydrant, but going to get the hit right back. Yeah, this is... Uh, this is ugly for Zedir at the moment. How is he going to use this? Oh, he's, uh, he's kind of waiting for Kershawn to approach, actually. I really like that. So Kershawn's done that a couple times now, where, like, after a while, he'll try to claim space with something unsafe, and ZD just like, well, I'm going to dash away. Now it's your turn to come to me. Yeah, and gonna... Oh, that does not mix up on shield, I guess, huh? Yeah, it doesn't mix up unless it's uh, Are you... above it. I was scared. I thought ZD honestly was going to pull the trigger, and I think it may have just hit. Because... Yeah, that the hitbox extension on the hydrant. They're gonna be near. Oh, the, that was incredibly was, smart by Kershawn. You can do that out of like you can do that out of what's it called? Um, hit stun. Well, yeah, no. Um, there's what Terry's special move, Buster Wolf. You can do it out of Buster Wolf. Like there's just it has really low startup. Yeah, I think it's frame between one and three. Yeah, and it gives slight invincibility, and you die to that back there. Now this is. This is hard because oh you messed up too. Yeah, you're gonna have to try to find a way to take the stock. Yeah, and it's it's looking very ugly. Just trying to play against ZD when he has a lead is like as someone who does it before, it feels like a bottom five feeling in the world. He, ZD's just super good at keeping his lead and trying to get it back. Oh, there's the touch. Actually tries to go off stage with the back air, I think, but instead get the tilt, and that is not gonna work out. And now. Kershawn gets the, get apple. the apple. That'll do. 45 degree angle. ZD not quite prepared for it. And the wall of back airs comes out. Yeah. May not be a kill move, but it sure is good. Gonna get some small damage on the board there. Ready for ZD to land uh, with him there to, to break the hydrant, but not gonna get anything off it. ZD's been doing a really good job parrying these uh, falling airs from Kershawn. I have no idea what that grab was. I think maybe he was anticipating the air dodge from ZD, but that's not something ZD does. I think ZD could die to a uh, F smash soon. Like, he's... What? Is... Oh, no, that's really bad. That is really bad. Oh, just he has the fruit. Kershawn has no, has no options. Yeah. Uh, oh, he tossed it out, though. Yeah, and he couldn't continue his combo there because of the lingering hydrant. Oh, off stage, though. Oh, he's dead to the neck. He's dead if he gets hit by that. But if you get hit by that, you're fine. No. Callus going out far. He went into the magnifier with a nair to try to get the kill. And it hit the. And it hit the <laughs> fruit. Yep. This is super scary. It's incredibly tense here, and Kershawn just kind of waiting for those little like water boosted options off of the hydrant to perhaps boost him into victory here. He has the bell out. Some more trickeration, and he crosses yep. up ZD's shield. No, the the water. water, the water saved him. Fruit is out. ZD has to go low. What's the recovery? Goes for the down air, and ZD air dodges. Air it he, only got one hit, so he didn't hit the wall. That situation is so difficult for players to react to. You basically want to di in, and then tech immediately. That's not reactable. Multi-hit moves that you can, you can kind of control which of the multi-hits you're going to get the trade with, depending on how fast you fast fall. So because of that, really Kershawn gets to choose when ZD has to tech or if ZD has to tech. Because of that, ZD he bet wrong. Yeah. He, he said, most times you're going to force me to tech here. Oh, so we went, but that was most times. We went town, which means, which means uh, I think at least ZD didn't ban two FDs last time. I wonder what his second ban was. Maybe, uh... Maybe Smashville, but uh, or Bastion, one of those two. I can see a Hollow Bastion ban. That is just a big stage. It's the same size as FD with the platform in the middle. But we're gonna see. I can see this Cal fix. It's a platform definitely does help at times to mix up how you approach and the ways you can get around it. But on the other hand, it's still a big stage. However, the so small side blast zones are very nice, and that causes jump. I think he had the jump there. Like, he was DIing towards the platform, and ZD, you know, he would have gotten that tech chase. So, Kershawn put into a couple awkward spots, and ZD gets the appropriate punishes. That was a, a very nice in general from ZD. Oh my god, getting the <laughs> jump off. Thanks the for the jump there, Pac Man. I could take another one. Because, okay, so Kershawn has been very. Oh, that was super nice. Kershawn has been very good at spacing his narrow round because ZD just is not. 
it's safe enough that Krishan could just um, nair and safely move away, but ZD followed up this time and punished him for it. It's safe, but it's only because, of, you know. Oh, don't. The air dodge there. And the side B kind of gets him back to stage just about for free. I didn't think that Nair was big enough of a disjoint to claim the bell. That's, that's just, surprising. I think it's just a hitbox in general. Oh, you lost your fruit. Drag, drag down, down. But that's it's... not going to matter. Pac Man, his recovery is easily going to get him back from that spot. Okay, we have a shark. Oh, you're dead. You cannot grab there, especially with Pac Man grab. Like, sure, it, the fact that it lingers is fine, but it lingers. That's the problem. It's out. Yeah, it, we've seen a couple of those where, like, Krishan does it at, like, full screen. And, um, and it's a bit optimistic. But, yeah, getting stuck at ledge there is ZD. And that bouncing Hydrant slowly moving around to take that stop. I love Hydrant so much. It just messes up so many interactions. As a player, it's tilting as heck. As a commentator, I'm just like, oh, I know that guy's frustrated by this. That is indeed an interaction <laughs> we just saw. Oh! He doesn't have a double. Yeah. Uh, he gets that tech every time, though. He didn't even need to tech it. It was just not strong enough to do anything. Should be spot in air for... Oh, yeah, no, he it. actually disjointed he it. Jabbed. He jabbed. He jabbed. That is a move right there by ZD. The single hit jab disjoints the Hydrant and claims the game. MDSR is on. He can't go back to Kalos. I imagine he does not want to go back to town. I imagine ZD banned FD. So yeah, this is the point where the stage does PS2 tend to. Maybe? Oh, maybe he banned PS2. I can't, I can't. That feels like a Fox stage if I've ever seen one. I don't know. I think maybe they, right here. Like, maybe right here you change your, your bands up and leave town open and uh, ban PS2. But I can't, I cannot imagine ZD banning PS2. That just doesn't sit right to me. He leaves Final D open. Interesting. So I don't, so, so he just, maybe he just didn't ban the FDs. Interesting. Maybe playing the long game. Maybe you're making sure he's fine. He's maybe fine, yep. Yeah. Th those trampoline situations could put this into such an awkward spot. Oh, that's so bad, yeah. Gonna be able to get, get a slight charge on that. This is very, this is always starting very bad. In general, there's the whole thing of don't take, don't take ZD to FD. He but, really likes the stage, yeah. And if you're a Pac-Man, you're probably fine going to FD. At the same time, just having to be, oh, that was a nice angle. I don't think I've seen Kirchhoff, like ever bounce off the one. There we go, talking about those nares. They're safe, but if you don't space them well enough, you're just going to get punished by an up smash out of shield. 42 damage off that extension. Really good one by ZD. Tons of damage here. Pushing his advantage stage so well. It just feels like Kershawn, he gets a straight hit, but he's not really making much out of it. These edge traps have not been working out. He never gets a chance to set up, and he never runs away to set his stuff up. He always wants to be in ZD's face, and that has just uh, not been paying off. Oh, he had the idea there, but no. The idea was there, not the actual play. And the push from the Hydrant. Don't even need to dash it. This is, yeah, this is why you don't take ZD FD. Yeah, I'm surprised. This is definitely one of those, like, stages that's really good for Pac-Man, but it's, it's better for Mr. ZD in particular. These small interactions, you just, you mess up once. Yeah, and Pac-Man just doesn't really have a ton of combos that rack up a lot of damage. Like, he has the Galaga combos, but we just have not seen him in a position to use those too well. The back air will go ahead and claim that stock. Great setup with a stun on the bell, and we need to see Kershawn get one of those high damage strings starting right here, but no, the Galaga successfully diffused by ZD. He's still doing fine, not on doable at the same time I mean, oh not that is that could have broken shield that could have been the stock right there and needs to punish that up up smash and one thing i haven't seen him do actually is like just instant turnaround uh item toss like yeah, he, he, he hasn't had that at all yes oh this is really bad oh it's back those not him out of here yet but should take it, yeah. So Kershawn in this. Yeah, the door it has not yet been no, closed, but uh, no. 
So yeah, we were talking about how Krishan certainly could do it. He was playing a lot better on that last stock, but unfortunately too little too late. ZD has an eight with Grand. Yeah, you can see Krishan and ZD talking it out. Krishan once again, definitely a player who always wants to grow, always wants to learn. Agreed. Oh. That's why I love that mentality by him. He, he's, he's one of those dudes that like, he'll, he'll beat you and then he'll be like, you played really well. Can you explain to me why X worked? 